Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Well, I've been asked just recently about my workflow and how I process an image. So obviously there's no sport. So I've brought Harry and the dog down and he's gonna do a few runs past me and I'll pretend that he's a football player or a sports, or I'm at a sports event and uh, I'll go through my process with you. Let's have a go, should be fun. <laughs> Come on then. That's it, well done. Lovely. <laughs> So I've done my quick Harry and dog shoot on the beach. Let's go through the process. Right, so first off, let's open up Photo Mechanic. Go to Ingest, Primary Destination Folder. Now I've set up a, a folder here on my desktop and it's got raw, that's where all the raw files will go, unedited, and then obviously a ready file ready to send. So we'll go into Primary Destination, onto Desktop, into Beach Shoot, Choose RAW, the RAW file that I've just created. Open that. Now, obviously, this stationary pad has got all your details in. Obviously, the last time I used it was for a, a weather shoot, uh, just some, some weather pictures of the lighthouse uh, last week, if you can remember. So we'll just leave that in there, just for argument's sake. But this is what would be embedded onto the image before I send it. So we'll close that for now. We'll pretend that's all all right. So we'll give it a sequence. So we'll call it just... Uh, Beat shoot, doesn't like gaps, so we'll just put that in there. Start the sequence again, reset, okay, close that. Now, the shortcut for the sending file is Command U. So obviously, my stationary pad is here. That's where I'll write the description in a moment. Let's just change the sequence there. Beat shoot again. Now, tell you what I haven't done so I'll do that now and you can see me do that I need to choose where I'm going to file my sent frames so we'll go back into there and we'll just create another folder call it sent so now we'll go back into choose onto desktop and then sent now I know whatever file I send will go into there so that's that done we'll just check the best beat shoot this is all the same, never changes, this doesn't. As you can see, resolution to fit box, three and a half pixels, that's the max. Maximum file size will be two megabytes. Obviously all in JPEG this is, so we'll close that. Right, so we'll go back into ingest, just check that's right. So I've got my file chosen. We know the pad's right. Right, that's all okay. Right, so I've got my lock button set to rate. So if I just press it there, it gives the image a one star. So I'm just gonna rate these images. And then when I upload them into Photo Mechanic, they will appear at the top of my page. So I'll just rate the ones that I like. Let's just skim, oh, that's quite a nice one. It's quite a nice one. It's quite a nice one. So we'll, it did run past the other way. So we'll just skim through. That's nice with the needles in the image there. So I'm just rating these. And I know that these ones will then appear at the top of my page in Photo Mechanic. And to set that rate button, you just go into your custom functions and set your lock button to rate. Obviously you can set it to record. When I'm sending off the back of the camera, I'll set it to record. And then I just hit that lock button and that records my caption. But for today, sending off the laptop, we'll keep it as rated. Let's just double check. I've got my incremental ingest. That will only ingest new images. So I'm gonna tick that. So now it'll auto ingest what it should do. Let's test it. I'm now going to download them images. So out the camera. Here it comes and they're ingesting auto ingesting, so that's great. As you can see, I took some moon pictures last night and I didn't delete them off the card. Here we go. So what we're going to do now, we're going to change file name, we're going to put, change it to rating and it will bring all them rated images to the top. There we go. I shot in RAW actually, I should have shot in JPEG, it's doing a bit quicker. But... And basically, so let's just, I 
quite like the look of that one. Right, so I'm going to double click on that. That's my shortcut for Photoshop, so click on that. Should bring it in because I'm in raw, I shot in raw, it's brought my camera raw out. We'll just open that and ignore that. So get ready to crop it when it opens. I've got three and a half by two and a half inches, so I'm just going to crop in on that. Get the horizon set. Looks about right. Quickly going to give it a bit of sharpening. I'm quickly now going to set up an action, an action for me to save. So let's choose new action, F2 we'll call it, record. So now we're recording my new action into file, save as. We'll go into ready, save, save it full quality, close and stop and that's it. So I'll just go through the process again. Now before I, I would go into, let's just open up, open contact sheet, desktop, go into ready, there's that image in there ready. I would now double click on that, let's just take that off. That's my full crop. Hit Command U. Quickly write in there in my caption. Harry runs past with his dog. And then I would hit close and hit send. And then that would send straight off. And that's my process. So let's just run through that once more. So let's go back into there. Let's choose a different one. Let's choose this one. So double click. Shortcut into Photoshop. Ignore that because it's a raw file and it shouldn't be, that's my fault. So get ready to crop. So the crop tool's already up. Just take it in there a bit. Get my horizon set. Just take the horizon down a bit. That'll do, double click. Give it a bit of sharpening. I've already sharpened once, so I know my settings are right. So yeah, that's okay. You can hit Command F and that will automatically do it. And then all I'm going to do, I can't really see the colours out here. I should have brought my sunshade out. It's quite bright, but let's guess that the colours are right. I would then hit F3, uh, F2, sorry, hit F2. That's my action. That's now gone straight into my ready folder. There it is. Quick crop. Command U into the IPTC stationary pad, write that again, Harry runs past with his dog, close, send, and that would then go. Well hopefully that's given you an idea of the, the process, my sending process, right from downloading the card right to sending it off. So uh, nice and quick, so you can set up the F2 key or whatever F key you want for the, the quick save into your folder, then straight back into Photo Mechanic, Command U, write in your caption, hit send quick as that so hopefully that's given you an idea <laughs> not quite a football pitch but the next best thing <laughs> thanks for watching guys leave any comments uh, below and I'll get back to you as quick as I can enjoy the rest of your weekend take care